What's up, duelists? You know what it is. You know what it is. It's a fan favorite deck. It's Vayu Turbo. It's the ultimate two turn clock deck. You go Greffer, you pitch the Vayu, you summon the Armed Wing, you deal 4,000 twice, and the game ends. Two turn, yep, clock. If you guys like this video, if you guys like these types of things, make sure and like this video. Make sure and leave a comment. I love to read your comments. Best part of my day, sometimes, unless the comments are stupid, in which case, uh, worst part of my day, but uh, don't, don't, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Most of you guys are dope. Most of you guys are dope. <laughs> anyway, anyway, sick deck, sick deck. We got a few notable inclusions. We got the Cold Wave and the True Nave. I'm pretty high on both these cards in this deck. If we're going for the two-turn clock, we got to be able to sweep all back rows. Not just one, not just two, but all of them. And then we got to prevent them from being activated with the Cold Wave. We've got a few other Light Sworn names in this deck. We've got a Chain, which is a target for Rhoda. And we've got a Lila, which is a target for Recharge, Charge, Recharge. And then we've got Recharge. Recharge to pitch our Light Sworn, draw two, mill two. I think this is a cool little inclusion that I was put onto by a user in the Discord named Frico Suave. He's a powerful, powerful value duelist. I'm a little bit sold on the one Recharge plus Cold Wave Trunade package. I think this is a cool little way to set this deck up. We've got Gores and Chaos Sorcerer in the main. The additional lights make it a little bit easier to play Chaos Sorcerer. Sideboard, we've got some special ones. We've got Smashing Grounds for the hero matchup. The hero matchup with this deck is actually really bad. I think this deck struggles with hero beat specifically. Much, much more than it struggles with the uh, Diva Hero. The Diva Hero is not so bad because they lose to oppression, but the hero beat deck, it gives this deck a lot of trouble. So I've got Smashing Grounds. They're not the best. I might move towards like snowman eaters that was the next thing on my uh on my checklist of things to try but this deck does struggle with hero beat might want to add something to it to make it a little bit better against that deck got triple dd crow i think dd crow is super important right now it's really important in the value mirror it's really important against miracle fusion deck it's really important against light sworn which can be a bit of a troubled problem matchup for this deck since we are playing the Light Monsters, we don't get to play Light Imprisoning Mirror. Our next best thing against Light Sworn is DD Crow. DD Crow also helps against Frogs. I like it a lot there. Another card I like against Frogs is this Morphing Jar. Got the Trag for a little bit of defense and as an additional deck dev target that you can special summon out under Royal Oppression. Love Trag, love Gores in this deck. I think they're both really, really good inclusions. Got a Knock for decks that are trying to set like Quick Draw. Got some extra spot removal for spell and traps. Extra deck is pretty standard. We are missing the Red Dragon or Thought Ruler. I've elected to include an Armory Arm. I've had multiple times where the Armory Arm comes up, synchroing with the Plague and a Ryko, so I've decided to include the Armory Arm. It's also a Light for Chaos Sorcerer, which also comes up. Anyway, you guys like Vio Turbo? I know that because uh, I see the analytics. I see the videos you guys like. I see what you search in the toolbar, all right? I see what's going on. I see what's behind the scenes. I know you guys like Vio Turbo, so... Make sure and leave a like on the video. See you guys in the matches. Got a game versus Copit. Good luck, have fun, Copit. We won the rock, paper, scissors. Picked scissors, scissors gang in the chat, in the comments, in the whatever. I never don't draw value with this deck, but at least this hand drew Greffer. I think we are just gonna do the classic Greffer pitch value. <laughs> Make an armed wing turn one. Fuck it. We have a really good hand. Let's just press it. If this breaks, then we get Armageddon Knight for Vayu, which makes Armor Master, which is great. I'm super happy about this. Let's run it up. Set, set. Good luck, have fun, opponent. Good luck, have fun. You're gonna be taking 8,000 damage next turn, baby. 8K. I think we have lethal. I could be wrong though. Let me do the math real quick. Main deck, DD Crow. <laughs> and they drew it after we summoned the... Uh, oh, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. We don't really want the opponent to be going off here. I actually think I want to solemn this. Yeah, I think we just want to kill our opponent. We don't want them to fix their hand. None of that shit. None of that shit. Okay, here's Lila. Summon's okay. They have to get a lucky mill. I'll say it. They have to get a lucky mill. Oh, they're gonna attack. We're gonna, we're gonna mirror force the shit out of that. What? What? Get the fuck out of here! No, <laughs> no. What? 
Yo, dude, no, no, <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, did we just win? I think we just win. Let's see, Armageddon Knight sent Plague. Uh, yeah, this should just win. I believe it just wins. Armageddon Knight sent Plague. Where is that bad boy? Uh, plague. We'll put Necroguard on top of the deck. Special summon out the Plague. This makes Goyo, so that's 68 plus 13, which should be 8,100. This should just be game. If they have Gores, we'll just take it. If they have Trag, we'll just take it. No biggie. 1,300 first. Yuppers. Get the fuck out. Two turn clock, baby. Two turn clock. You already know what it is. Two turn yep clock. All right, Light Sworn. We have absolutely nothing for Light Sworn. Uh, whatever. I mean, Cold Wave, Heavy Storm, Trunade coming out. Trag seems good. The Crows seem good. Jar doesn't seem bad. Jar really doesn't seem bad. And I don't hate these these uh, cards here, the Nox and the Smashing Grounds either. They could be on like Consecrated Light, but Smashing Grounds pretty bad against Consecrated. Well, we don't like our spell and trap removal. Lila can also come out. Let's swap these out. Let's see how this looks. Pretty bad. Pretty bad, honestly. It looks looks kind of weak. I think Cyber Dragon's pretty good. I'm going second. Maybe over Raikou, we'll set out the recharge. Swap these. Then I think we want anything else? Or does that look good? Royal Oppression's not great in this matchup. I actually think it's quite bad. We could side knock. It's not that bad. Over an oppression. Is that gonna bite me somehow? Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. These games are going to be short anyway, so I feel like knocking the starters is going to be better than, than oppression in the starter. Opponent gets to drop for turn. Okay, cool. They remembered. Nice. Nice, nice. Alrighty. There's a foolish. Is that for a wolf? Turn one wolf. Is that what we're staring down? Looks like a turn one wolf to me. Alright. Fair enough. Solar recharge pitch wolf. Didn't want to draw into the other wolf. Fair enough. Fair enough. Mill the second name. Okay, they have two names now. Would really like to find Didi Crow or that knock. That knock would be really good. Plague, a trash drop. But we are going to start things off with charge. I believe. I think it's better to charge first. Because we only have three targets. Mill the Crow. Fuck. Punished. God damn it. <laughs> We still have two more though. We still have two more. Let's grab Jane. Let's grab Jane. And now let's Allure. Allure found Vi or not Vi Greffer and Bottomless. Okay. What can we do? We could board wipe them. Banish the Greffer, board wipe them. Next turn we have Burial Dad Jane. We could even Burial Dad this turn. Uh Huh. Let's banish Greffer. And let's, let's just board wipe them. I don't want to give them three mills with the Raikou. If it's a Necrogar now, that's so fucking lame, but... Whatever, right? You know? <laughs> Whatever. This plays around Honest, too, which I think gives us a little bit of trouble. Blow it up. Was it a Raikou? Fuck yeah. Let's go, baby. Okay. Okay, we got two darks. We've got a bottomless. And we've got a pass, I believe. We could get in 2800 now. How does that work out? If we 2800 now, it doesn't change our clock. So we'll just pass. We'll just pass. Yep, pass. Here's Lila, bottomless. Easiest bottomless my life, baby. Easiest bottomless my life. I would love to find a DD Crow. That would be the best possible draw here. That's the next best possible draw. Okay, let's go for it. Let's go for the two turn clock. And then we have Dust Shoot to back it up. Burial, put back Greffer, Burial Resolves, Special Summon Dark Arm Dragon, Normal Summon Jane, Attack 1800 into the opponent, and then 2800, it is, it's actually 4600, 500 more. Alright, cool. Alright, end phase, mill 2. See what we milled. We milled Sork. Eh. 
At least it's a dark. And now we get a dust shoot. Hopefully this just locks things up. Opponent has recharge Aaron. Yeah, we just take Aaron. And that's game. They can't do anything. GG's. Two turn clock both games, baby. Two turn yep clock. It was a quick one. It's two quick ones. Two quick ones. Yep. Yepers. You have no place. GG's. GG's. No GG's? Come on, man. That was a good game. That was a good game. I thought we played well. I thought we played well. All right. I thought we outplayed our opponent there. Maybe they were a little upset. Fair enough. Fair enough. But what was in their hand? What did they have? They had Recharge, Cold Wave, and Heavy Storm and JD. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Did we sack them? I guess that's the question. We had Burial, Dark Armed. We had Allure, Charge, Plague, and Dust Shoot. So we did have a fair number of limited cards. I think game one, we we wrecked them. We all played them. But game two, we might have sacked them. Let's get another game. That was, that was too quick. That was too quick. We got a game versus 2010 Tools. What's up, 2010 Tools? Good luck, have fun. I'm picking rock. They're picking rock. I'm picking paper. They're picking paper. I'm picking paper again. They're picking rock. No, they're picking paper. I'm picking paper again. Whew. Got him. Got him. Triple paper. What do you know about that paper? You know what I'm saying? Gotta get that bag. Gotta get that bag. This is the second match with the Bayou deck. And our hand, it's all right. It's all right. I've never had a hand this mediocre before, but you know what? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Thank goodness we're playing more than just Rikos in this deck. I think we're going to lead off, actually, with... It might be Summon Lila. I think that's what we want to do. I think we want to mill three. I think we want to set the oppression. Set the other oppression. I think we want to end phase mill three. That's what we want to do. Mill the Plague. Nice. And a Sirocco. Fuck yeah, dude. Fuck yeah. Great mills. Actually great mills from the Lila. If we went for Raikou there, it's not as pressuring. You know what I'm saying? We're on the play. Now our opponent's like, shit, do I set a back row? If I set a back row, is it chainable? What not? Oh, they're on 42 cards. Interesting. Uh, Yeah, basically Lila's more pressure. It's like, we're going to mill now. We're going to mill now. Next turn, we've got the Greffer Necrogardena. Get the Sirocco Vayu. This Gold Sark, it's not going to matter. You're not going to make it till this Gold Sark, baby. It's the two-turn clock. Okay, that's what I'm saying. It's the two-turn clock. Sark for charge. You're down bad. You are down bad. The whole rent. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. This is actually just game on like six different levels, right? Greffer, Greffer effect, pitch Necro Gardena, send Vayu. Oh my god, dude, come on. Come on. And we have brain control too on top of all this? Dude, dude, come on. Okay, okay. Vayu effect activates. Banish, banish. All right, we're gonna go into the armed wing here's the plan we're gonna attack with the armed wing first they're gonna pop either greffer or lila i think they're gonna pop lila i could be wrong though if it's a raiko that's what's gonna happen they might go after a back row it's a hamster all right that's fine that's fine that's fine i guess we attack it with the lila this way we get the mills if uh if they choose to pop the Greffer. Okay, yeah, they're gonna pop the Greffer. Good. 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 Mill your three cards. Mill your three cards. Alright, they milled double Raikou too. It's a true mirror match. Alright. Hmm. We've got Plague, we've got Necro, we got M phase mill three. I'm liking the way this, this game is shaping up. <laughs> milled all three Raikos. That's so funny. Uh but our other mills were great, so I can't really complain. Cannot complain. That's why I kind of like the Lila in this deck. If you're going first, it's like much more proactive than the Raikos. No, 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 no. Next turn. Next turn, 2010 tools. It's only been one turn. <laughs> you do not get that this turn. <laughs> you wish. <laughs> you wish you got that this turn. <laughs> 
Oh, if only Gold Sark was one turn, <laughs> it would be truly broken. <laughs> you would play it in every deck. <laughs> one turn? Fuck, that's broken as shit. <laughs> I'd play that in every deck. All right, all right, let's see what the opponents got. Let's see what they got. They got a pass. They've got a pass. All right. All right, for us, that means we've got clock. What's our clock like? If we go Armed Wing, Sork, Goyo, I think we just attack with both, try to get in the most amount of damage. Main Phase 2, Sork, Banish, Dark End, Pop, and then just be, be in, in command position. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Lila Direct, 1700. Let's see the Gores. Let's see if they have it or not. No, no gores. Okay, 2300 direct. Let's see if they have the gores. Gores? Any goresers in chat? No gores. Wow, okay. Looks like we're just set up to win then. All right, we'll set bottomless and we'll pass. And we'll mill three. Milling giant trunade. Good. Didn't want to draw that one. Dust shoot would have been good, but hey, here we are. All right, they've got charge. They've got a hand, dude. They've got a hand. They can't cold wave us, thankfully, though. Can heavy storm us. They milled a third Ryko. We both milled three Rikos. The Ryko mirror. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, here's Lumina. That's going to get oppression. <laughs> oh, just kidding. Pitch Jane. Okay. Okay. I see you. I see you. Mill Wolf. Mill Wolf. We are going to oppression the wolf. That is not going to exist. Yeah. Yeah. It's tough. It's tough out here for the Light Swarm player. It's tough. If you don't have Heavy Storm, you're boned. Gold Sark for JD? That's not happening. It's not happening. You got another Ryko? Shit. You got four Rykos? <sighs> Uh, we can just uh, stack for Plague, I believe. No, that's not great. It's likely Necrogardon, I think. We'll attack it with Armed Wing, though. Because either way, they'll have to negate. Another Hamster. You have no more Rikos. You have no more Rikos. Get that Hamster out of here. Two Hamster. Two Hamster?! One hamster I could understand, but two hamster? Hmm? Really? Really two hamster? Let's set the mirror force and let's mill. All right. Mill, no more values. Tough. Tough luck. Tough luck, but the opponent's got another turn. They have to wait for their JD, and we win. Off a rematch. Game two? Game two? Question mark? Looks like we're playing game two. Let's fucking go, baby. I think we played against this earlier, didn't we? How are we citing Trag and the Crows? That sounded great. Trag and the Crows. Don't love oppression. Although it was good there. They're on double hamster. It makes me want knock so much more. And Cyber Dragon going second is not bad. Okay, how else was I citing? Ryko out, Lila out, Cold Wave, Heavy Storm, Trunade out, and we'll bring in the Cyber Dragons. And we'll swap like that, and we'll just run it. Let's go. If you guys like these kind of videos, smash like and subscribe. <laughs> On our way to 4,000. Actually getting getting up there. I think we just broke 3220 or something like that. Which is hype. Edison hype. Love to see bigger number. Bigger number, better person. I actually want to do a really big giveaway of 5,000 subscribers. So if you guys aren't already subscribed, definitely consider it. Definitely consider it. Game two. Game two. Our hand is ass this hand is so bad what the fuck okay Sirocco makes it better Sirocco does make it better that was a great draw because if they do have a hamster Sirocco runs it over that's that's what you love to see really and it is a hamster perfect 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 this is exactly exactly what we wanted I'm going to set trap dust shoot and I'm going to pass my turn they're going to flip the Ryko they're going to target the trap dust shoot then we're going to chain it <laughs> that's how it's going to go that's how it's gonna go. I'm out here. They're gonna target it, and we're gonna chain. See? It's like we knew. 
It's like we knew. Their hand has an honest Jane and a Celestia. Hmm. That's tough. That's tough. I think we want to take honest. Because we can beat everything else. So we'll take honest. They have wolf, two, Celestia, Jane, Necro. Putting back any of the other cards also increases their chance to mill uh, Light Swarm Monster here. Uh, you mill three for Raiko. They mill three for Raiko. They do gotta mill those three. Okay, they have DD card, they have Lumina. Okay, okay. We are gonna lose our Soroku here. Big Satch, big Satch, but no Raiko direct. Okay, they wanna play around the Gores. Nice. DD Crow is big. DD Crow is big. Big. DD Crow is big. They milled a second crow. And Heavy Storm. Okay, perfect, perfect. All how we drew it up. Okay, Vayu's coming down this turn. Vayu's gonna attack over the Raikou. You know they have Celestia, Necro Gardna, and Double Wolf. We need them to not draw a Solar Recharge. They've milled a good number of cards towards a Solar Recharge, but that would be like the worst thing for us here. And I think we're good to go. I think we can kill them in a reasonable fashion. Reasonable fashion. They have two Light Sworn names. Maybe check in their graveyard for Light Sworn names. If they sack Jane for Celestia, we are going to chain Bottomless. But we're also going to see what they mill off Celestia. Because we might want to crow if they get to a fourth name. Okay. Targets. Uh, let's see. They're going to target only the back row. This is a smart play from the opponent. And since they only went to three Light Sworns, we're just going to chain Bottomless. Okay. Now they only have three. They have Wolf, Wolf. They're going to pitch Monster Reincarnation. Uh, we're going to chain. We're going to chain Crow, target Sork. I should have waited to see what they target. That was a little bit of a mistake on my part. But either way, this is fine. They have Double Wolf. We're big chilling. We have two Darks. We could tribute set Caius, special summon Dark Arm Dragon, and give them one turn. And I'm on board with doing that. I think that's what we're going to do. Tribute set Caius, special summon Dark Arm Dragon, banish, banish, special. Opponent's had enough. Admits defeat. Leaves the duel. GG's 2010 tools. Two turn clock, baby. Two turn, yep, clock. Two matches, two turns, two clocks. Smash like, subscribe, E3 Yu-Gi-Oh, signing off. Peace out, everyone.